Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the free-to-play. Um, it is Sunday here. Um, so, oh, I, that's, I was trying to remember before I clicked record what it was that I wanted to update you guys on, because I knew I said I would update you guys on something, and it was Hydra, which I didn't do off-camera like I said I would do. Um, I don't have that much to talk about today, so maybe we'll do Hydra on the video, and people can just yell at me in the comments. Um, <laughs> again... But <clears throat> cool, some some interesting updates. So in missions, uh, Demon Lord, or sorry, we completed all of those missions that required us to um, craft potions, and <coughs> excuse me, and um, and run those things uh, multiple times. I wanted to point something out too. Give me one second here. <coughs> all right, I'm a little bit better. I wanted to point something out about the the keeps. So you'll see here, I'm actually doing the hardest difficulty now of the keeps for at least two of them. Now, for magic and spirit, it's not the case. It'll I could probably do magic. I think I have enough accuracy on my Sun Wukong. Spirit keep, it probably won't be able to do it until I either have an enemy max HP, like hard-hitting uh, champion, or I get a more... Like a, a good champion that also brings heal reduction. Um, I don't want to just throw in a cheapo rare to just to apply um, heal reduction on this one dungeon boss. You know, even if I'm doing it at like stage 17 or 16 or something. I'm still going to get enough resources that it's not going to hurt me at all. Um, and then for the magic bosses, just if you can steal the, which Sun Wukong can, if you can steal the shield, you're good to go. So um, I feel pretty good about uh, that dungeon as well. So the main thing that's helping me get through all of those now is that I have a reviver and uh, someone that can increase my defense and give me strength in, in the form of Ursula. So she has made a huge impact on the account. Um, honestly, I haven't even used UDK anywhere because Ursula just seems to really do the trick. She's just that good. Um, and it's it's interesting because, you, you, you know, when you see a reviver that doesn't bring healing, it's like, well, what, what good are they? But she's just so darn good, uh, especially now that she's fully booked out. Her cooldowns are super fast. Um for the abilities and everything so happy about that i've spent all day running hydra on the main account um with the new acrisia that i've got leveled and built up uh just need books on her which we'll be waiting till the next clan b clan for that so um so that's where we are on missions so the only reason this mission isn't done because this is very easy for our account to do this is multiple keys you don't need to do it all in one key um, the only reason it's not done is because uh, I just finished. I've already used my keys and have uh, finished it. So, like, if I do, I could do Demon Lord right now, but I think I'll wait. I'll, you know, I made you guys sit through one yesterday, right? So, wow, we did 14 million on our one this morning. It's not going to be the same against Spirit. Um,. <clears throat> spirit is a slightly harder for us because we have two magic affinity uh champions there so um well wait no they crit against spirit right yeah so spirit might be better <laughs> uh but he does get the the clan boss does give a, a decreased speed that i don't have a, a cleanser to get rid of so you know little little give and take there but um let's see so we talked about that. We'll do Hydra here in a second. As far as events go, we do have a Soulstone Rush coming. Um, these ones are are interesting. Usually, I I always get them mixed up because there's the Soulstone Rushes and then the um, the ones. So I I think the Soulstone Rushes give rewards based on whichever ones you pull it doesn't matter what you get the other version of it which i think is the tournament version gives you rewards based on what you pull 
So you don't have a way of calculating how many points you're going to get. But for the rushes, I think you can calculate. You can go in and say, okay, I'm going to get this many points and look at where you are in the event <clears throat> and decide if you want to spend now or wait until another time. Um, and I think... So this one is based on just spending the the soul stones so it doesn't matter you you won't get points from from pulling any of these these guys or anything like that so um <clears throat> sorry my i got some stuff in my throat and my allergies are going crazy so my nose is running a little bit um so i got i'm sniffing sniffling i apologize if you guys are, are picking that up so <clears throat> I'm probably going to hold on to this madman here. I don't know if you guys have been paying attention to Hydra, but apparently with a ally attack team, this dude can be pretty nasty. There's rumors he might... I guess not rumors is probably a wrong word, but there's a possibility he might get nerfed, um, which is what some content creators seem to think, but um, I don't know. I hope not, because I was thinking about building him i've got a lot of ally ally attack champions so it'd be kind of nice to have to be able to put them to use somewhere i mean i use one of them in in uh clan boss so it's not a total loss but um okay so why don't we go do hydra now the one thing we're gonna bring this time for hydra over our last time we'll bring udk now, normally on Hydra, I go for the defense aura. 30% defense, that's a lot of survivability, and we could use that. And I think I'll go with that this time. Um, we'll, this will be the team I bring. We will have, we'll, we'll miss Apothecary's speed a little bit. And it's highly likely that we're going to get our buffs stolen. This is a difficult week, kind of. Um, or at least it felt like it was on my on my main account. Um, I don't really... We're all about to go, so I'm not going to give myself turn meter there. And then... Yeah, the, the fear head is going to be a real problem for us. So, I'm, I'm going to use this first to toughen us up. Now, granted, I might just be giving that away to this head, but do I land the block buffs? I do. All right, cool. This might be a decent enough week for us to do when you... I wish he was a little bit faster. If he could go before this head. Okay, let's start over. Cuz I'm I'm betting if I go if I do Deacon's ability first. And Yeah, so now he'll get to go hopefully. Um I'll still give us a little t strength here. There we go. Now we can land the block buffs. So now the poison head doesn't give the the damage reduction on any of these champions. So that's something that we want to watch out for. Um, I'm gonna go for the poisons because they don't have uh, the wow. None of them land. Okay. Um, I do want to avoid hitting this dude as much as I can since I don't have a cleanser and I don't really have a way of dodging it. You can see that block buffs. He stole the buffs off my champion, but he doesn't get them, which is why that block buffs is is very, very handy on this fight. I'm going to go ahead and give us some shielding. We have no real way of getting rid of the taunt here. Those poisons are going to be a problem. Um, We don't have a green head to hit. I don't want to hit this head. I do want to go bring the de well shoot I'm about to bring this decrease attack but this will give me the increase attack so we're gonna use it as well. Um, all right, we want to try and speed us up here. I don't think Sun Wukong is gonna have his buff steal up yet. 
Yeah, one turn away. Um, he's got... Yeah, we'll hit this head because he doesn't have any increased defense on him. Uh, let's go... We'll hit this guy. That's not the best target for us, but... Dang, two minutes on the on the revive here. Um, so they no longer have the increase. Oh, well, it doesn't matter anyways. We're actually on a decent pace. All right, here we go. This is the big... Oh, it got feared. Oh, no. Oh, no. We're... This is a disaster. We need her to stay alive. I don't have a way of doing it. They all have increased defense here. So we'll go against the one that's green. Ah, uh, all right. So what I'm going to do differently this time, I'm going to save the revive. Because it really didn't matter all that much early on. So we want this first. We want this. Then we, we're going to use this. Burst out that damage. Put the block block buffs out there. Uh, let's just go for the big nuke. I I, I know it's probably better to, to try to put the poisons, but none of them landed last time. I don't think he has the accuracy. I'm glad the burn lands there. As he... A good target swap for us. Um, we'll get survivability from these shields instead. Get some turn meter. Get some decreased defense out there. Gonna save that for when people die. Hit this head, because if I target this head, it's going to target one of the ones I don't want to hit. Same thing here. Ah, oh, I got feared. We'll go with the decreased attack. We're not worried, really, about the, the healing out there. That hurt. I have to go for one of these other heads here. We just need to squeeze out another 600k. Um, I'll hold it just a little bit longer. Let's get that block buffs out there. Alright, we'll do the revive now. Oh, did it get feared? No. Which kind of fear was it? The good fear or the bad fear? <laughs> ah, she's going to die of the poisons. Okay. This is why I wanted to do it off camera, because I feel like I'm just going to be doing this over and over again. It's so hard without cleansing or a or a shamil. Like Inquisitor Shamil just makes this so easy. Uh, well, that sucks. Oops, I keep forgetting. This is probably already a restart, honestly.
a pretty decent chunk of hit in there. Alright, she's not feared this time. But I don't know if we're going to take a big hit before she goes. I think I need to wait one more turn. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. I feel like we're there. I feel like we can get this in one key. I really do. We just need a few things to go our way. There we go. We got the block buffs this time. Didn't land on him, which sucks. So I really don't want to target this guy. Good news is it's kind of forcing my hand on a lot of these fear procs right now. On their, so they're getting uh, taken up by A1s, which is good for me. Uh, I'm glad to proc that now. So we don't have to worry about it later. Get it out of the way. And then we'll be doing the revive here in a, in a, in a little bit. Uh, landing smite is pretty good there. Okay, I can hit. Oh, well, I get, doesn't matter. What was that? A counter attack? All right. I see he's under fear. I'm gonna I'm gonna hold off one turn here. Yeah. Aha! Validated. Alright. Not gonna use the multi hitter on the guy that'll explode me. Oh, he got feared again. Well, maybe. <laughs> Yay! I was going to say, he's going to go down. Please don't get feared. Hey, haha. <laughs> well, we got the minimum chest at least. Her being feared is a problem. And taunted, so she's not going to get a chance to revive again. Oh, she's going to die before she gets a chance. Get some extra damage in here. Ooh, that, that scared me a little bit. I don't think we're going to be able to free Sun Wukong. Yeah, but hey, I'll take 1.9 mil. I'll keep that result for sure. Let's take a look at where we're at. So, 2.2 .2 is all we need to get to get the next chest up. We're definitely going to try and do that. Uh, We're at 19 minutes. Okay. Bop, bop, bop. Bop. Yeah, I just I don't know who to bring. They're all solo armager. Um, Selenia, I guess. We really just want Husk to take a turn. That's like all we want. Prefer it to be done when he they're not under Poison Cloud, but, you know, it is what it is. Yeah. 
not going to be enough. So what's my total? 2.03. I have no other, you know, if I, if I throw any of my other, I'll show you guys what happens when I throw all my other somewhat leveled champions in there. It's kind of funny to watch. Oh, I could have used her for the increased speed in all battles. I didn't even think about the aura. Oh my god, I get a turn? I'm genuinely kind of surprised here. I don't think I can do 200k though, so yeah. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> but hey, I did an extra 6k. I'll keep that. I didn't think she would get a turn, if I'm being honest. So 2.04 million. We got that minimum chest. That's the important part. So Hydra's out of the way. We've got that done. Um, I'm just racking, uh, oh, did I get everything done on this? Yep, got that challenge done. The Forge Pass challenge, let's, since while I'm playing, what was, let me read it one more time because I didn't read it there. Uh, with at least one Force Champion, so give me some free wins. That might be one. Yeah, there we go. All right. So now we need a very squishy team that doesn't have the speed advantage. Maybe. Huzzah! Okay. Alright. Got her done. So, halfway there. We've got two weeks and three days left. I mean, we're a little under halfway there. So, we're, what, right on pace, I guess? I mean, because three days, you two, three, so we'd be here in three days. So, yeah, we're, I mean, we're, we're pretty much on pace. Um, I think I missed one daily challenge and it was one of these like use a force champion things that I, I didn't do. So, um, pretty, pretty happy with the pace that we're, we're going there. So, um, fiery singles, we're still waiting here. I've been spending my energy on places that don't get me, uh, gear, which is one of the reasons that I haven't been able to, to finish or get these points. I I'm probably... So we currently have a full set of food. I think I have a four star currently leveling up. I don't. So I'm about, I'm about, this is going to be my next food right here. Um, do I want to spend my energy getting food? Probably. I'm probably going to spend my energy just getting enough food. Um, getting all my, getting five, five star ready five stars ready for <clears throat> the weekend and we'll see what happens next weekend if there's anything interesting coming down from as far as two x's go also we should hopefully you know in a couple of weeks be seeing the next free legendary come out um which will be exciting um that especially from a free to play perspective we'll get a chance to to potentially upgrade um oh i just realized something i like i just stopped and thought for a second so we got ursula here and then we did sacreds so ancients will be next if it's not all three, Yumi Love's site says it's going to be all three, but 
But I think at the very least, the next 2X, whenever it is, we don't know when it'll be, but when maybe this weekend, but whenever it is, that's the important part, it will be the uh, Ancients at least. Um, which is very exciting. Because uh, that's where we have the most shards, and we also probably have the most towards our mercy there. So we might be coming up on a legendary here pretty soon out of the ancients. Now, um, you know, what I would really love would be some more epics, but some like top quality, you know, I like, I would love a geomancer. I mean, I guess everybody would, I, I still know people that don't even have their first geomancer on their account and I feel so bad for them um but yeah so okay i think that's pretty much everything i can can think of in the video i am going to use my energy to get one more five star food ready to go that's my that's where i'll be putting my energy um over the next few days i'm not worried about retaliation gear um, so, uh, so I don't really see a reason to farm ice golem as much. Um, and I'm pretty happy with what I've got from spider's den for now. So, um, yeah, dragon slayer. I didn't even realize I did stage 21 on dragon slayer. Wow. That's I mean, I knew I did stage 20. I didn't remember clicking on stage 21. I must have done it on accident, but hey, it worked. All right, yeah, I'm going to call that a video. Um, I'm about to film question block and get you all's questions. So please check that out. Um, it's where people that in the community ask me questions directly, and I will answer them on screen here. So... If uh, you're watching this and you haven't yet watched Question Block Episode 4, go check it out. It's on my channel. Thank you all for watching. Thank you for all of the support. It really means the world to me. Y'all have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you in the next video.